And as part of the centennial celebration of the 1906 quake in San Francisco, Mayor Gavin Newsom has initiated an emergency drinking water plan. Crown Forest Karen Holmes explains. This was San Francisco, April 18, 1906. A city engulfed in flames, its water system crippled, leaving its citizens without sufficient drinking water. Now, a hundred years later, Mayor Gavin Newsom turned the spigot on a new emergency drinking water system for San Francisco. This is a, a positive first step uh, in resolving one of the critical components of life, uh, and that is not just food, uh, but water, and making sure that we have distributed this system uh, throughout San Francisco. This comprehensive plan calls for 67 fire hydrants strategically chosen and connected to major water mains throughout the city. Those are close to feeder lines, which means they're close to major transmission lines, and that if they get broken in a seismic event, they can be repaired within hours. At the same time, we have these water trucks uh, that can drive around and also can be uh, fitted with a manifold with these spigots, so that's a source of water. Drinking water, potable water, out of city hire. This emergency plan ensures that San Franciscans will have drinking water, but this plan is in no way a replacement for individual earthquake readiness. Uh, personally prepared in your homes, in your workplaces, and to have a plan and to practice that plan, particularly if you have children, if you have pets. All right. Each designated hydrant will be painted with a symbolic blue water drop, letting the residents of San Francisco know this water is safe for public consumption in the event of a major earthquake. At the end of the day, three gallons of water is not going to help you if that's what you've set aside in your home uh, beyond a day or two or three or four or five days. And you're going to be coming to these 67 locations, uh, unfortunately, probably often, in order to deal with your emergency water supply needs. In San Francisco, Karen Holmes, Cronfor News.